In this video, we're going to graph the linear equation 2x minus 3y equals 9. Two ways we could do it. We could use this table of values down here, put values in for x and figure out y. It's a little bit messy and it gets to be a little bit of work here. So I want to use slope intercept form. I think that's a little quicker. And to do that, we need to reorganize this so it's in the form of y equals mx plus b. So let's subtract 2x from both sides. So now we have negative 3y equals 9 minus 2x. I'm going to divide both sides by negative 3. So now we end up with y equals 9 over negative 3 is just negative 3. And then a negative 2x over negative 3 is just a positive 2 thirds x. And then I'm going to rearrange this into slope intercept form where I'll put the x first. So now it's pretty easy to graph. B is my y-intercept. That's the negative 3. I go to the y-axis, find negative 3. That's where the line is going to intercept the y-axis. Now we have 2. That's our rise. 3 is the run. This is the slope. So we'll go here. We'll rise 1, 2, and we'll go 1, 2, 3 over here. We've got our point. From there, we could rise 1, 2, go over 1, 2, 3, and we'd have our third point. And you can see there in a line. Let's put the line through that. We'll put arrows to show it goes to infinity. And, and we've graphed the line here for the linear equation 2x minus 3y equals 9. And again, you could have used a table of values. you get the same line. This is probably just a little bit quicker. That's it. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.